my name is Colin. Welcome to mine to Minecraft story mode. We return. We re we return to the game. And we're and we are not done with this. And I think this might be the episode. This might be the finale of the episode. I'm not sure, guys. Okay, I'm not sure this might be the finale. I'm not sure. Wow. The nether. Yeah, that is a lot of lava. And fire. And other things that could burn you to death. Oh no! Yep. Oh, that's a drop. That is very, very much a drop. Talking about you guys. What drop? Oh crap! You weren't kidding. Here we go. I'm with him. Roller coaster, jeez. Oh no. Uh, wait, why is it you not duck? Oh my uh, head. Oh, that got to hurt, actually. I'm serious, that got hurt. So, I'm not the only one seeing that we're running out of track, right? No? Good. Jesse, that switch. Now, do it. Oh, arms don't fail me now. Yeah <laughs> wow. I thought something bad was gonna happen there, but <laughs> I guess everything's gonna be. Oh God! Whoa! Yes. Ah, no! Whoa. Wait! Oh man! Uh, Axel, Olivia, Ruben. <laughs> Hang on, Ruben. What do you say, bud? Yeah. Oh Ruben, God, glitching like crazy. Just fine before. I know I was wrong then, but I have a very good feeling about it. Whoa! off my to see list done with gas never need to see them oh crap bad this is bad this is bad is huh Everyone okay? I'm not dead. I guess that's pretty good. Ditto. Ditto. The not dead. I just can't believe that Petra comes down here all the time. This place is awful. <laughs> Your throat's gonna be sore later, Axel. Why? I'm just saying. Wasn't that you doing all that screaming before? Sounded like you were really shredding your larynx. We were just lucky to make it out alive. That's more than most people can say. Their bones are probably still sizzling away in that lava down there. Wow. Morbid. Sorry. Can you throw up, like, inside your body? Uh-huh. I know, because I just did. About five times. Wow. Look at this place. All these tracks converge at this point. You could probably get anywhere in the world from here. There's the portal. This is what Gabriel was talking about. That's our way out. It must lead back to the surface. The surface is also where that creature is. He's right. We have no idea what we're walking into. It could be dangerous. Thanks for being so brave, Axel. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm going. I'm going right now. Like right, right now. I'll go first. That's not what I was saying. I'm going. Well, if you absolutely insist. <laughs> All right. Well, it's 
See you guys on the other side, I guess. Be careful. I can't Thanks, tell Jesse. you. I can't tell you. God, I'm getting tired. Okay, not what I was expecting. close there was a zombie oh is it dead I mean you know dead dead yeah where are we in the dark in the middle of nowhere maybe we should bed down for the night it's dangerous to be out when it's just dark I thought we were headed toward a temple we're looking for a giant building it should be pretty obvious. Ivor said... No, Ivor said... Well, then maybe this is the temp... I'm being sarcastic. Axel, come on. Take it easy, Axel. You called me stupid. No, I didn't. But you wanted to. No, I didn't. Huh? Did you say something? We have to build a shelter. I thought that was what I said, but, uh... Yep, that's totally... <laughs> it's getting dark and stuff. I say we build a treehouse. That'll take forever, and we'll be exposed while we do it. We just need a quick and dirty hut. Look, whatever it is, we gotta do it fast. What? Treehouse. In a hut, we won't know what's coming until it's knocking on our door. Let's go with a treehouse. It's functional. It'll keep us out of danger. It's not a bad idea. All right, fine. Let's get started, then. I'm getting tired. Oh. If I wake up with a spider on my face, I'm gonna expect you to deal with it. Lower your expectations, Axel. Well, maybe if we'd built into the tree a little bit more, it could have. Never mind. It's. This is fine. It's good. Looks good, guys. Oh, man. What? I'm going to tell you something. You have to promise not to freak out. What is it? I have cookies. One for me. One for Olivia. One for Jesse. Thanks, Axel. And one for Reuben. <laughs> Sorry, Lucas. I only have four. Oh, no. It's... it's all right. I'm not that hungry anyway. I'll just... grab something in the morning, or... something. Take it, Lucas. <laughs> no, no. I, I... I can't do that. I insist. Thank you, Jesse. for you, Jesse, not him. If you had to, which would you rather fight? A hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Choose wisely. <laughs> uh... That's a good one. Let me think. How can you guys joke at a time like this? Petra is still out there. She's all by herself. There's nothing funny about it. 
about that. Petra wouldn't mind at all. She'd want us to keep our spirits up. If I were her, I'd... I don't know. It feels wrong. Fine. Then, uh... We should get some rest. We gotta start looking for this temple as early as we can. Now, my guess is if we start at the portal and kind of split no, up... Oh, what are you doing? Did I do something to you? I'd really like to know. Because you keep getting on my case for what seems like no reason. He's just trying to help. See? I'm sorry, Jesse. I'm not gonna sit here and listen to this guy telling us what's what. I'm just trying to get ready for tomorrow. You're the only one wearing that stupid jacket. Don't tell us what to do. Take that back. Can't. Wouldn't. You know what? I get to wear this jacket because I know how to build. But that doesn't mean I don't know how to break things. Your threats don't scare me now that we know how you really are. Jesse, your friend is way out of line. I wasn't going to bring it up, but I can only take so much. Take it easy, Axel. Easy? He threatened me. He's not going to do anything. Haven't you done enough damage for one day? Petra might be dead because of you. You're taking this too far, Axel. I don't have to take this. Listen, why don't I just leave and let you guys hash this out? You can't leave. It's dangerous out there. I can take care of myself. It's what Axel wants, right? Let him leave if he wants to leave. You're not going anywhere. But Jesse, that's enough. We're all on the same team now. He's staying. Zombie-sized chickens. That's what I would fight. Why is that? Because I'm starving. Of course. Rain is better than monsters. Thanks for keeping me around, Jesse. Yeah. Safety first. Achievement. We'll get over it. But still, the way it all went down wasn't good. Give it time, come around. Thanks, Jesse. Hey! There's something over that way. What is it? Some kind of building, I think. Let's get a closer look. trying to figure out it's the temple of the order of the stone Lucas are you sure he's right look holy crap do you think they're in there let's go in and find out let's just all be careful okay if you spot anything call it out we don't have a lot of time isn't it weird how dispensers are carved to look like spooky little faces? What do you dispense, little guy? I get the feeling that we don't really want to find out. Get behind me. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Can we get even closer by that? Yeah. It do get even closer each time we do that. There we go. Huh? That's probably not a good thing. Oh, come on, dispenser faces. I thought we were friends. Run! <laughs> We're 
trapped! We activated the dispensers with that pressure plate. If we can figure out a way to trigger it again, I bet that'll shut them off. There's a crafting table, maybe we can make something useful. Useful! We don't have anything. Useful. All of our tools and materials are back home. Alright, everyone, empty your pockets. Alright. Alright, let's do this. Alright, let's do this. Left over from building the shelter last night. I have some flint and a piece of string. All I have are some chicken feathers I picked up after that chicken machine exploded. Uh, let's see, I've got some flint and steel, a sword. Oh, and some string from a spider that I fought. String, sticks, flint, and feathers. What should I create? I should create a bow, an arrow. There's the fishing rod. <laughs> Arrow. Doesn't this look like Ivor's creepy basement? I see what they're doing. <laughs> All right, so we're almost done, and I shift. We can shift. All right, we read this. All right. The battle was fierce, but the order of the stone emerged triumphant. Saving the land and ensuring that peace and prosperity would reign forever. Well, not exactly forever. These five members, five friends, together would give so much to gain their rightful place. As five heroes, they would author their own end. They would slay a dragon. Ivor was a member of the Order of the Stone? The stories never mentioned him. This is so crazy. There must be a reason he's never been mentioned. Maybe he was different back then. Maybe they kicked him out. Man, I can't believe you punched a member of the Order of the Stone. This is so crazy. The Order might not be what we thought they were, but Petra is still out there. That monster is still out there. Jesse's right. We need to focus on what we came here to do. Where do these stairs go? They go up. They go up. Up to heaven. Yay, we're all dead. Hooray! Oh, this is cool. Wow. What happened to the walls? More like what happened to this whole place. This must have been where they met. So where are they then? Gabriel said that once we find the temple, the amulet would lead us to the Order of the Stone. Well, what are you waiting for? Pull it out then. Not actually, that's not the way. Not, that's not the way. Is something supposed to happen? Well, that was a letdown. There's got to be something we're missing. Look around and see if you can find anything. I'm gonna find something. I think I might found, find something. I don't wanna talk to the... Oh, God dang it, I'm having trouble. Let's get over here. Should 
try this one. There we go. This is really a puzzle. Okay. Oh, pull that. Ah! It's a map of the entire world. This is way nicer than the one at Endercon. It's the same as the animal. That's where the animal goes. Yeah. Now we use Amulet. Hooray! It's absolutely yeah. incredible. All right. How did they build this? Okay. Now I'm impressed. This is what Gabriel wanted us to find. It's the order. It's showing where they are right now. Look, we don't know enough about how this thing works. Maybe the amulet only tracks them when they're on the surface. Or maybe it doesn't work when they're in the nether. We have to go off what we do know. Petra's relying on us. That wither storm is still out there. We know that Gabriel was trying to tell us something. Ow, I just We've got to find the order of the stone. But there are only two lights. There are only two members of the Order left? He said Soren was missing. That leaves Magnus. Or Eligard. Let's head out. I'm not going with you guys. I have to stay here. If I know Petra, she's probably doing everything she can to find this place. She's still out there. She has to be. Right, you should stay. Just stay safe, okay? If there's even a small chance she's alive, I have to stay. Go. Get help. I'm gonna focus on making this place safe before nightfall. This temple is pretty big, though. If we're gonna have a chance of fortifying it, I'm gonna need some help. If, uh, maybe one of you guys can hang back with me? Sounds like Olivia will have you totally covered while me and Jesse are out finding Magnus. Finding Magnus? You really think that's how it's going to go? We need Eligard. She's the world's greatest engineer. She'll figure out a way to stop that thing. We're trying to destroy it. And when it comes to destruction, Magnus is the master. You're a smart person, Jesse. Obviously, the smart thing to do is to go get Magnus. I <laughs> think Axel meant Eligard there, Jesse. Uh, no. I don't think I did. Pretty sure Axel meant Magnus. Jesse, the point is you should be going to Eligard's. It's the clear choice to make. You've got to come with me. You're my best friend, Jesse. It's you and me. Like always. Think about it, Jesse. This is more of a gut call. We need to make sure we get this. Uh, it's Eligard. Olivia, you and I are going to Eligard's. Awesome. <laughs> Axel, you stay here with Lucas and get the place ready for when Petra shows up. What, with that guy? I'm right here. Come on, Axel. For Petra's sake. Fine, I'll do it. For Petra. I'll take it. Uh, guys?
please hurry. And that's the end of episode number one. Jesse and Olivia return to the Nether, intent on finding Eligar. Why is there intense the mood music? Engineer. And find themselves in a place of mechanical marvels, redstone rarity. Amazing machines, limited only by the imagination of their brilliant creator. While the great storm grows, consuming everything in its wake, time is running out for our intrepid heroes. All right, one episode down, seven to go. The calm before the storm. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you do like the video, share, subscribe, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.